Yo, what is up guys, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you tips and tricks on movement in Yeep's Hide and Seek. But however, before I get started into that, I have a huge announcement for you guys. I have a promo code. That's right, I have a promo code, and it is insane. And I'll be hiding it on, hiding it anywhere in this video, and you have to find it, and you can claim it. However, before I do put it up in the video somewhere, do not tell anyone in public, as this is a private gift from me to you. And if you don't tell people in public, then for, therefore, people who watch this video have a higher chance of getting it, as there's only a limited amount of uses. <gasps> so get your tickets quick to get the promo code, but just don't tell anyone, because tell anyone, it's a private gift from me to you. And because if you do tell anyone, it will go like the codes will go away quickly. Um, so if you don't, then people have a higher chance of getting a code who watch my videos. Uh, but yeah, I have a promo code. Yippee, yippee, yippee. And it will be highly in this video. Wait, wait a minute. Why is it? Why's the camera zooming? Wait, no, no, camera, stop. Camera, no, 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 stop, no, stop zooming. Out. Oh, great, it zoomed in on the promo code. Well, I guess you know the promo code now. <laughs> Be quick because it also has a limited timer. Yeah. Well, let's get into this. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to be telling you on how you can use movement without having to walk is going to be using the pulse grenade. So, what you're going to need is you can have one or two. So, I'm going to use one at the moment. You throw this down, grab it, and put it behind your back. As you can see, you will move. And you can do the same with two, and you'll go double as far and high. Another way you can do this by traveling even further is by using one of the launch pads. Let me show you how. So you're going to want to get your two pulse grenades, throw them down, make sure you launch, and do that. Look at that! That is crazy! Hey, did you see how far I went right there? The next way you can move is using the snowballs. Yeah, you can move the snowball. If you repetitively hit yourself, you will notice that you will go up. So to do this, you're going to want to lay down. It, it, like with the fr uh, flipping mechanic, and you're gonna constantly throw these at your face. Okay, so you got your two like that. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Let's go. Holy cap! I went flying. Holy! The third way you can move is using the ice bomb and the pulse grenade. Because when you're using the ice bomb and you get frozen, anything that hits you that makes you move, you start going flying. So if you do this. You will just go straight up. Here it is in my POV. As you can see, you fly up. And you can also do this with the firework. When oh, I saw him. I saw so you throw guy. this down. Oh, boy. oh wait. Throw this down. Throw, throw the firework. And even if it let go, you go up, up, and away. The fourth way you can move with the movement mechanic is zip lines. So if you're on a zip line with normal colored paint, you'll notice that it goes slow and pretty much just like the gorilla tag zip lines. However, if you want to go fast and just go straight on on a zip line, use glowing paint because glowing paint will make you go faster. Wherever you're moving, it will just take you. Like you don't need any energy. You that no energy now got up. The fifth way with the movement mechanics uses the frisbee and you can double jump you can that's right you can double jump with the frisbee as when you throw the frisbee it has a hitbox which means when it's in the air you can dap it and you'll jump watch it in action so you throw the frisbee don't do it too fast otherwise you won't get it that was too slow that was also too slow that was also too slow like that and hit it and just like that i just double jumped i can do it again and you can just keep doing this as long as it's in the air. The sixth way of the movement mechanic uses the gun and the freeze ball. How you do this is you hit your head with the freeze ball and then shoot yourself with the pellet gun. Just like that. Here's my shoot perspective. Alright, look at that bro. I'm flying! The seventh movement mechanic uses the umbrella. The umbrella is does just as what it is. You can be Mary Poppins. By going into fans, you'll fly up, and as you fall down, the air will push it, and wherever you angle it, you will move. Just like this. I'm Mary Poppins. Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Oh, 
The final movement mechanic uses the grapplers. In case you don't know, with the grapplers, you can swing around like Spider-Man. Let me show you. So to swing around, you're gonna wanna push this grip right here. And wherever you aim, it will shoot with grapple. But as you can see, it's not doing it right now. That's because there is a certain distance you can shoot. There, like there I can shoot. But like, oh, there I can. Can. If I get, oh. And up there too. But if I get right here, I can't. As you can see. And what you can also do with these, is when you swing around to pull yourself up you're gonna push your arm down and bring it up and repeat that motion and then this is also how you swing so if i get somewhere where i can swing like underground to stop you from just staying on the ground you're gonna want to like push up as soon as you let go so like that as you swing up and then you'll find yourself being able to swing more fluent final thing you can do with the grapplers is you can slingshot yourself. So I've got this set up. I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna try and walk back without pulling me back. Like this. And then, as soon as I jump, it's gonna flaunch me. Okay. I know that. So I'm all ready? Don't freeze me, don't freeze me. I'll do it Tag me. Just like that. Anyway, guys, that will be all for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed. And use that current promo code. Just don't tell anyone. Bye.